Hello friends and welcome to this session. This is the new scenario based questions on the Terraform. If you didn't refer my previous videos on the Terraform, you can refer those for to have a more clarity on the Terraform topics. Till date, we covered around 22 parts of the Terraforms. Okay, and several new topics needs to be covered very soon. Okay, so in this particular scenario based questions, you want to create a Terraform modules that can be reused across multiple projects. Okay, so this is the advantage of Terraform modules that we can re reuse it across multiple projects. But you need to parameterize certain value so that they can be customized for each project. How can you accomplish this in a Terraform? So whenever the concern regarding the Terraform modules, this is used to change the certain value for the parameters. Okay, some parameters value we set it as a default. Okay, so that if it is not passed, the default will be value will be picked. Okay, so before proceeding, what is the Terraform module exactly? So a Terraform module is a set of um, Terraform configuration file in a single directory. So we keep some tf.tf file which is the extensions of the Terraforms into a directory and we call it as a module. Suppose you created a modules for the EC2 instance, you just call that particular modules and the source where the module is located and use to create a EC2 instance. So you don't have to configure each of the things like which instance type you want to use for which reasons okay so things needs to be uh, passed as a default value which is required and if you want to change it you can parameterize it so this is the things we are going to look into this particular sessions so terraform allow you to create a parameterized modules using the input variables okay so input variable allow you to pass the value into a modules from the calling code to create a parameterized modules you can define input variables in your modules using the variable block so when you create a modules you define a variable okay you define a variable and you define it for the reason okay in this particular block you define the type you restricting it to use it for as for a type like a string as will be small okay and the default you are providing here okay this is very um, means good uh, steps to always provide the default value otherwise it will ask you to provide at the runtime okay and the resource sections you define for the AWS instance okay my uh, name it as a local my EC2 and here you define the AMI okay here you have the AMI value the alpha numeric character the instance type suppose I am providing T2 micro and the reason I am providing where here I am taking it from the variable here from here okay where dot reason okay and now close it so in this case you can see that uh, my ec2 instance the aws instance resource is parameterized uh, by the reason input variables when you call this model from another terraform configurations because this is you are creating a module that you can reuse or you can reuse in different different projects 
so you can pass it in a different value for the reasons okay suppose you don't want to create uh, in a uh, us east one but you want to create in us west two but you want to use this particular module and parameter and pass the parameter for the reason so how you can do that so simply you just need to use the module in your different projects or you can say in the same project if you're creating uh, the instance using this particular module okay here you define the source this is the path of the directory in my case we have in the similar projects my ec2 and the reason we are providing here us west 2 okay so in that case let me close it in this example the my ec2 module is called with a value of us west 2 for the reason input variable okay we are passing the reason as an input variable where we defining we are going to create this particular modules that we created earlier for different reasons we are go now going to deploy the in situ instance in this reason okay this allow you to reuse the same module across multiple project with different configurations so i hope this explanations um, help you in un understanding the modules uh, very soon i am going to create um, the new session for the modules in the data form playlist if you didn't subscribe my channel yet please do subscribe it this always motivates me to bring uh, new videos on different different topics of the devops okay thanks for watching this video have a nice day